From SBI's Executive Briefing Center in Dallas, Texas, the most watched and listened to content in B2B sales and marketing, it's the SBI Podcast with your host, Matt Shares. Welcome to SBI TV, a weekly show dedicated to helping you make your number. Today, we're going to explore the true meaning of customer experience. What a topic. I'm your host, Matt Shares. I'm the CEO of SBI. Joining us in the studio today is Brad Christian. Brad's the Chief Customer Officer of Market Force Information. Market Force serves multi-location businesses by providing a wide array of customer experience management solutions, analytics, and reporting technology. If you think about their solutions, they help clients protect their brand reputation, they delight them, and make them more money. So Brad, first off, welcome to the show. Thanks, Matt, great to be here. Yeah, good to see you. If I was not familiar with Market Force, right? Where would I bump into your solutions? What would be an example where I'm like, oh yeah, that makes sense? So Market Force provides a, a variety of what we refer to as customer experience solutions. These are a variety of different measures that we use to help different brands uh, evaluate how they're executing against customer expectations. And, and kind of our secret sauce and what makes us different is we have a large variety of those measures uh, and then uh, a sophisticated analytics process that allows us to tie the results from those measures to financial performance to help our, our clients really understand three critical things. One, what matters most to their customers? Where do they have gaps in execution? And ultimately, what's the financial ROI they can derive by taking on one initiative over another? A lot of times, executives get in a room. You talked about the different functional areas. They all get in the room. And many times, those executives have a lot of experience in their business. Yep. Uh, and so they come to the table with a lot of gut instincts and intuition. <laughs> and they say, I've been doing this for so long. I know what the customer wants. The curse been... of expertise. Yeah. 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 And, and what, what we see all the time, and in fact, it's interesting, sometimes we even surprise ourselves. When we let the data do the talking, when we take the operational measures, when we take the customer feedback, when we take what they're calling to complain about, and we let that flow into the analytics process and the modeling and, and tie that to financial performance, the insights that are derived from that process sometimes, always, almost always surprise the executive team but even sometimes surprise us and allows us to give them what we refer to as a strategic blueprint for investment. So here's the uh, possible uplift in your business. Here's mm -hmm. the ROI that you can chase. And here's the area that you need to focus. And based on work we've done with other clients, you know, the motion that you might want to drive yeah. for this particular initiative would be this. Yep. And we think based on the analytics, you can see this kind of return. And that allows all of the executives at the table to align behind a common goal because it's no one person's idea or um, focus. It's a data-driven outcome or a data-driven insight that everybody can rally behind. 